Negro! Beverly. He can't pass a fucking ball? Beverly. Jesus! He can't pass a ball! Go, 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 man! Pause. Now, if you think that this dude right here about to just dunk on somebody, give me a heat. Or if you think he just going to somehow just out of nowhere, just Mr. Dunk, clear open lane. Hashtag fuckboy in the comments down below. Mike! I'm done here, dude. I'm done here, bro. The team is just uh oh! by Chase Money. Yeah, Chase Money, the bald head dude, the dude who like uh, uh, the black quarantine, you know the guy Mark come back, yeah, him. Um, I got challenged by him. And also, before I go to this 76 channel, I want to challenge 200 people. And also, I got challenged by Eric Jones and whatever guys didn't know Eric Jones, he challenged me well. So I got two people challenge me. So I'm gonna challenge two people back, you know what I mean, son? You give me two, I give you two, okay? So I am challenging, one person. But I know for sure he's gonna beat this. See Nick 2 4 And I'm also challenging Jays of the Laser. Okay? No practice, no, no cheesing, alright? You die right in, man. You just dive in the game. You just die right in that pool. Alright, man. You die right in. That's how you do it, bro. Alright? So, I am challenging C Nick 2 4 and Jays of the Laser. I know for sure it's gonna be a good game, guys. Make sure you spam on okay, how you get up with the attention. Let them know the 2K Messiah, my team. The challenge on the whole line, right? 76 challenge. How you do it is you cannot practice, you get the right and the dive ball then, mate. So see what I get into. Sixers are back in Philadelphia for this game. These guys facing good ball clubs and will continue to over the upcoming season. Even more critical to not you win in this one. You know, Kevin, sometimes being at home gives you a chance to, to refocus and stop the bleed when you've not been playing well. Mike. There's something about being in your own building and having your fans supporting you that gives you that extra energy that sometimes can turn around poor play. Yeah, this could be this dude baseline cheesing, bro. Season, you Don't fucking faggot. Right God here. damn it, man. You're gonna turn it around. Now's the time. The dude straight baseline cheesing, bro. Here's the starting group for Houston. Beverly and Harden man the back. Howard is up there with Bonnie Eunice. And it's a reason in a, the small Come on, do it. position. Make a shot! No Jesus, the whale! Here is Mbaa Mute. The great Elvin Hayes. I get something going, bro. Well. Some kind of play. Jesus, Jesus. Could, could, could this is murder. To Yao Ming. I mean, what, what a litany of wonderful players in the history of that franchise. Go! Michael Garwell to the wreck! Let's go! Uh, the photo included uh, a lot of those uh, former Rocket big men. And uh, I think it's, it's a good fit. He seems to be very comfortable. But I cannot see I'm legally blind. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. I'm in it. Really good young Are you that fucking blind, Noel? Good. Damn it, man. Get the fuck out. Hey, I'm going to go with you. Don't do it with you. Let's go. Kicks it out to Hardy. Six on the shot clock. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, babe, come on, babe. Hello, cousin. Oh. 
Really, nigga? You can't pass a fucking ball, Negro! Up the floor. Negro! Beverly. He can't pass a fucking ball! Beverly's that's his first foul. For the Rockets. Why are we fouling him every play? He already free throws! He already shoot! And it's Terry in for Patrick Beverly. Pick and roll. He keeps that thing on the string. The, the team IQ is, it, it, it is crafty. He is, bro. That Manu Ginobili. Rockets leading by three. Come on, come on, get that, get that, get that. Oh, that's good. Please, Terry's got his first three points. Have mercy. Please, I'm begging you. Too many open looks like that. I mean, that's just in trouble. Ah, 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 ah. Tough to hit that shot when you got the defense right in your shirt. Come on, man. Come on, come on, man. Come on, we got to get this. Come on, man. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Why are you shooting? Good pass. The they get the rebound. Grant down low. Covered by Brewer. Thompson passes to Aldemir. A second chance effort. And he was fouled on the way out. Two seasons. He says he's motivated by his critics. And he's come on, come on, come on, come on, right here, right here. Tom key, Tom key, Tom key. With the chip on his shoulder, he feels he has a lot to prove. And it's sent back by Howard. Rockets leading by six. Ariza has the open look. The quick look, no good that time. And by Amute, this is to Carter Williams. Carter Williams with another miss. And for Dwight in Orlando, I think he might have done some things differently. But Los Angeles was a tough situation, not really of his making. That was created by external forces, I think. And once he did decide to leave, it got worse. And really was beyond his control in many ways. His toughness was questioned. His basketball IQ kind of became a personal attack on him, which wasn't Come on. Fair. A bit, you know, I can understand why he might hold the grudge. Stolen by Harden. Chance bucket in a big pile. And those hustle points, Clark, I mean, that's just Make a shot! The lead here. And for Dwight Howard, there are always gonna be ruffled feathers when you leave the city behind. Certainly that was the case in Orlando and, and Los Angeles. Yeah, and there may have been some indecision as well that led to Thank you! Frenzy, the story just Thank you! I think in the end he ended up exactly where Bruh. he needed to be. With an up-and-coming team and a good score. And they're ranked third in outside shooting. Three-point percentage, that is. Man, Clark, this is a team that scares opponents because of that steals number that you talked about. Uh, they're so good at anticipating plays. They seem to have a good scheme defensively, night in and night out. They know their roles. They make their rotations. They read the passing lanes. And they frequently get out there, make steals, and then get out in their transition game. Boy, this is how you completely rattle an opponent's rhythm. Yeah, you know, such terrific on-the-ball defense to trigger the transition opportunity. And it wasn't just the tough D, it was the exclamation point they put on the fast break with the slam. The putback, and then Thomas with the chance. He sniffed out that board and then powered it back in. Pure Mike Clark, so strong going back up with that one. That's exactly what he's capable of, guys. So strong. And they're going to count the bucket and... WHAT ARE WE DOING?! Bruh. I'm not doing it all! Thank you, 2K Service! This is the only time I ever thank you! Thank you, Base God 2K Service! Fuck that! Not again!
Not again. I'm on the this shit, bro. No one can goddamn shoot the ball. They can't even dribble it down. But why, bro? How, how is this even a team? Is this even a team? I feel like, I feel like, I, I feel like I was in high school playing with the JV squad versus a, 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 a championship caliber. I'm done here. Scenic 2-4. Jazz laser. Have fun. Good evening. Hey!